Hey everyone, how's it going? I hope you guys are doing well. So we are, again, we are back with the ESO. I hope you guys don't mind. I hope you guys are enjoying the ESO videos. Um, but we are going to be doing the quest today to get the other companion, which is Miri. Now, to get this quest, you have to come over to this side of the map, um, over to the Doom Vault. Volpinus, I think that's how that's said. I don't know. Um, but uh, if you come down here, then you find a note along the floor, or at least that's how I found. Yeah, it's over here. Adventurers are wanted for an exciting opportunity. Um, so brave souls uh, sought to explore a newly uncovered ruin once in a lifetime opportunity for glory and gold. Inquire about the expedition written in another hand. Big job seems less than legal but the gold's real. Meet north of Fort Redmayne. Bring friends. See you soon little brother. Mary. Okay so um the last one is from Mary and that is the companion that we can get alongside um, uh, Bastia. So it'd be cool if you could have both companions active at the same time but I guess that's a little bit uh, cheaty. So she is a dark elf. I probably will not use her like really at all to be honest. I might give her a costume <laughs> and that's probably about it um, but Bastion or like the male companions will be my main companions my if they bring out any new ones or anything you never not know help you mount a suicidal rescue mission then you can observe me kicking every fetching cultist's ass standing between me and my little brother okay who are you another of these useless layawin layabouts no you're an adventurer like me don't tell me zigira roped you into this mess too uh, no, what's the trouble? My little brother and I answered a job posting seeking adventurers to help explore a newly discovered ruin. Only once the expedition got underway and we were all split up, our employers turned on us. I barely got away. What's your plan now? Free my little brother and the others before something terrible befalls them? I don't know if I can do this on my own, but I have to try. Can I count on your help? Well, where all the questions just morbid curiosity i can pay if i have to uh, i'll help you with your rescue i guess there were five in addition to me who got duped into this my brother liam eolof a nord warrior adia a high elf researcher djos an argonian scout and galor a wood elf adventurer other than my brother i don't know a lot about them uh what do you know about the ones who tried to take you captive not much Zagira, the woman who hired us, was charming. I didn't buy a story that her expedition was for study, but she paid half our fee up front. I figured they were just treasure hunters looking for plunder. We had no idea they were a cult. <laughs> when did you realize? About the time they said, don't kill her, we need her for the ritual while trying to wrestle me to the ground. Probably saved my life, though. I fought twice as hard knowing they were taking it easy on me. No one else escaped that I know of. Uh, okay, I'm ready when you are. We didn't get far with our expedition before things went sour, but the ruin was in pretty bad shape. You'll need a grapple bow to get anywhere quickly. Fortunately, I have a spare. They're simple enough to use if you've never tried one. Okay, and I, I straight off the bat, first impressions, I'm really not a fan of her, to be honest. Really not a fan, but hey oh, we will get her anyway because she is, you know, part of a quest. <laughs> And it'll just be interesting because I think her and Bastion have like different likes and dislikes. Um, we need to reach the base camp, but be careful. I saw a lot more cultists during my escape than the ones who led me here. Bastion doesn't like it. I don't think he likes me crafting like alcoholic beverages or something like that because I was doing my daily crafts the other day and he disliked it when I made like some food or something and I was just like dude what is wrong with you it's freaking food <laughs> um, but he also doesn't like killing people uh, like assassinating people but I don't think that Miri minds that so there's that
I'm still kind of from the last episode of the ESO that we did looking forward to uh, I know it's like a, a quite a while away yet but the whole finding the other ambition and stuff like that I don't know I just left it on a cliffhanger that I'm not like I wasn't I mean it's not even like I guess it wasn't even like sort of a proper what you could class as a cliffhanger but I don't know I was just a bit like eh with it there's lots of bookcases around here though so hopefully Bastion will like it if I just keep reading this is cute where are we going? this way oh yeah exactly not our sky it wasn't work with me before. we should have the bridges out but that support looks sturdy enough for the grapple bow the grapple bow this is pretty though this is nice the sky oh the sky i do love the sky oh look at this oh i have Base to camp should be eoloth what are those fetchers doing to him that's Yolof. One of the other adventurers Zagira duped with this setup. They've got him strung up like a new life pony gua. Survey <laughs> stones my ashy arse. That's a sacrifice if I've ever seen one. We've got to do something. Survey stone? Zagira had us escorting her scholars around the area to place those so-called survey stones. Supposedly, they would get the layout of this place in an instant. Bunch of gua dung, clearly. It's sucking the life out of him. Can we destroy it? I damn well plan to try. It'll be dangerous, though. For Eolof, most of all. That ritual is already feeding off of him somehow. A sudden shock of destroying the stone might kill him. We could try weakening the ritual before ending it entirely. How do we do that? That array by Eolof seems to be the heart of the ritual, but the magic is being drawn to another focal point nearby. Destroying that might lighten the load on Eolof and the backlash of ending the ritual by force the best chance of saving him okay let's go we need to stop that ritual the sooner the better but Yolof's chances of surviving go up exponentially if we try picking it apart carefully instead of smashing the central ray right at the start the grapple bow should help us search around okay <gasps> okay okay endure nord the footholds oh, are nearly complete the ritual's weakened that voice ah. Yolof, follow me quickly we have him as a follower. You don't have to tell me twice. It'd be cool if they had like a bunch of different um, followers that you did a quest for and then at the end of it you could choose like one follower to keep. Thanks, thanks mightily for getting me out of there. I, I don't know how much longer I could have lasted. Uh, sorry, uh, what was it what was it they were doing to you? <sighs> Trying to pitch me into Orki's gnarled teeth. Or Dagon's, rather. Felt like all the air was sucked out of my lungs. Would have killed me if you hadn't come along. Or is it always this hot in here? <laughs> do you know what they were trying to sacrifice you? Uh, do you know why they were trying to sacrifice you? I'm just hired muscle. I don't meddle with magic. They... They were talking, though, about positioning the other stones. They sent each of us as an escort, split us up. If they got the better of me, I'm sure the others are in just as much trouble now. Will you be all right? Haven't felt this bad since I nearly drowned in the sea of ghosts. But I can feel my strength coming back. I, I think I'll be good enough to move once I've caught my breath. I'll be fine. Help the others while there's still time. Okay. It worked! Sorry if that sounds too much like surprise, but I couldn't be sure if that would be enough to save Olaf's life until we tried it. If the cult is doing this to the others, we should be able to free them too, if we're careful. Any idea what it is they were trying to do to Olaf? It was definitely a Daedric ritual, but not your typical sacrifice. Offerings to the princes are usually quick and brutal. This was much more purposeful. I don't know what they were trying to accomplish, but they were using Yorloth's soul to power it. Do you know where the others went? 
the oh, Swiss didn't tell us much of their plans before stabbing us in the back, but I've got a rough idea where they were taking the other stones. If we head out the other side of these corridors, we should be on the right path. Okay. Yeah, I'm still I'm not a super fan of her so far. Bastion just seems like uh, he seems like he seems sweeter. <laughs> like he just seems super sweet. So. But I still would really like like maybe a really burly Nord guy or like who's drunk or something like that. I think that that would be a really funny companion. Use my power. Yeah, yeah. I think that would be really cool. More books for Bastion. More books, more books, more books. And the other side. Can't forget the other side. Hold on. I recognize that journal. It belonged to Ardia. I know I should have mapped as I went. Uh, surveyors turned on me and as soon as they got away from the rest of the group. I tripped and my cloak tore free so I bolted. <laughs> Well, I'll be. Ardi actually made a break for it. She's the last one I'd have expected to escape. Two left feet, that one. Much as I'd like to believe she made it out, somehow I doubt it. You, th you think she was caught? Honestly, I'm impressed she made it this far, but my gut tells me she's still here. I, I think we should keep looking for the rest of those sacrificial stones. Whoever's still bound up in the cult's rituals is in the greatest danger. Understood. It's getting to the point that I hardly recognize this place. It's like the sky is on fire and everything's scorched. Did the cult come here just to destroy this place? Oh, that hardly makes any sense, but Daedra Warship too often doesn't. Oh my goodness, it's Lava. so beautiful. And look, those trees. The shifting is more drastic here. The sky is... Get out of my way, Mary. Jesus. The sky is just like super pretty. Oh, goodness. Wait. Bastion just teleports. <laughs> Bastion has no grapple. Bastion doesn't need a grapple. He just goes in the water. <laughs> it's like, wait for me. Oh, funny. Up here. Looks like they caught Ardia after all. We need to free her. Okay, so we need to grapple and grapple. Destroy. I don't think I need to talk to her because you I think I know what to do. I look forward to reuniting you with your brother. Let's keep looking. I think that's all of them. Now, the array. Come on, Anya. Watch your step. Wait, no, go away. I, I'm just a little unsteady. Oh, I do like high elves. Normally, I love new experiences. It's why I got into exploring. Not that one. Never, ever again. <laughs> she looks so cute. Uh, we found her journal. Oh, I thought I'd never see that again. Thank you. I have a great deal to add to it now. I think it's good to record all you can, good and bad. It forces you to think about what you've seen and done. It makes you more mindful of how events shape you. Uh, did you learn something that we might find helpful? Zigira was yelling at her followers about jeopardizing the foothold when I was trying to escape. I don't quite get what she meant, but I think they're turning this place into their stronghold. And I saw Zigira when they caught me. The real Zigira. What do you mean, the real Zagira? Among her followers, she dropped the mask she'd been wearing. She's a Daedra. These cultists are the usual misguided fools dabbling with things they don't really understand. They're true believers. I'll never forget how they howled for her adulation. I like her hair. It looks different to any... Oh no, wait, we do have that hair. No, we don't have that hair. I like it though, it's nice. It looks like Ardia will be alright. Hopefully she can make a successful escape this time. 
Uh, how many more of those rituals do you think there are? I can't be certain, but Dejo, Scarlor, and my little brother Liam are still missing. We have to assume they've been captured and bound like the other two. We need to stop these rituals, and not just for their sakes. What do you mean? I have a theory about the purpose of these rituals. The changes to the land, the sky, the blasted heat. I think this place is being overtaken by another plane. If I had to guess, I'd say it's becoming the Deadlands. Dun dun dun! Uh, how is that possible? I think this ruin isn't actually part of Nern. More like a piece of our world bottled up, and the cult is trying to fill the bottle from another source. All the more reason to stop these rituals. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Find the remaining expedition members. Okie dokie. It's cool how it, it's done like that. Um, like what she said, like it's just a piece of the land. That's bottled up and it's it, it's cool how the two seem to like cross over. Like with the uh, main quest or whatnot. Garlo! Over here! Aww, is he dead? Garlo! Oh wait, he's not. Oh, fetching back! Uh, uh, he's vacant. He's oblivious to the world. Aww. Should we put him out of his misery? Oops, That's oops, it, partner. Oops, oops. Oh, that's you. <laughs> Soul shriven. I've read accounts of this happening, but I've never seen it myself. This ravaged body is all that's left of Galor. His soul gone somewhere far worse. This is what will happen to the others. To my little brother. Only if we fail. Right. You're right. This isn't the time to lose it. There's still hope for the others. Galor couldn't have wandered far like this. There must be another ritual site nearby. Let's go. Wait, why are there two Miris? Wait, 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 wait. There are two Miris? And they're doing the Miri quest. That's like, that's like paradox stuff. <laughs> level her up like a little bit but I I don't know she's definitely not my favorite I think Bastion and he was just like he was like medical partners it's like oh thank you <laughs> thank you so much um okay. is it and they've got Dijos keep her this focal point is finished, but it wasn't the only one by looking at Yeah, yeah, I think I saw it around here somewhere. No! Okay, I'm gonna die. I'm so gonna die. Ah! I'm going the wrong way. Don't do this. Don't don't follow me. Don't follow me, Bastion or anyone. Anything. I don't know if I can get up here. Oh yeah, I can. They knew somebody was going to be as stupid as me. <laughs> they just knew it. Keep me, me. And I'll make you watch your brother waste away! You came back for me? We did indeed. We did indeed. I was just going to say, can't leave a fellow Argonian down. But I, I've made an Argonian once. And I deleted it literally as soon as I got in, as soon as I made them and like they were in the game, I deleted it. I don't know what it is, I just, I'm not an Argonian fan. Thanks to you, there will be something left for the Hist when my time finally comes. But I did not expect the Dark Elf to stick her neck out for me. Why not? Dark Elves have not been kind to my egg kin, and I have not been kind to theirs in turn. I see I judged her too harshly. I should apologize to her and her brother, if he still lives. He was taken prisoner by Zagira, personally. Uh, do you know where she took him? To the heart of the vault, she said. Further down this path. Where it leads, I cannot say. I don't even recognize this place anymore. I only know it dries my scales worse than Ebonheart. Okay. Oh wait, we have to speak to her. We managed to save her. I don't know if that'll improve her opinion of me. Well, my kind. But I'm glad. I wouldn't wish what happened to poor Garlo or on anyone. We've accounted for everyone but your brother. Liam. Hang in there, little brother. We'll find you. 
We seem to be getting close to the heart of the cult's plot. Other than the ruins, the terrain here is unrecognizable from where we came from. I'd wager that's where we'll find him. And Zagira. You want to go after her too? No. I don't care about that hooded viper. I just <laughs> want my little brother back. But if she stands in our way, I'll gladly kick her fetching ass back to oblivion. <laughs> Come on. Liam needs me. Oh god. I think you left him. He needs you, but you left him. I keep talking about the sky, but it's honestly like the best part of <laughs> It's honestly the best part of like these type of lands, in my opinion. Sakira! Give Liam back, and maybe I won't fetch and kill you! Allow me to reward you for hampering our progress. You may listen to your brother's screams, unmolested, as you stand helpless before this gateway. That sounded God, absolutely She horrible. sealed the gate. We need to remove that barrier. That switch might have something to do with it. I think that did it. The gate's unsealed. Let's find Liam. I feel like that's the thing with me some days. Something seems obvious. Sakira, oh, if you it. think a little lava is going to stop me, you've got another thing coming. <laughs> Lighten I mean, their burden a bit. It might not be enough. Look for other focal crystals. She's from like Evernot. Now, so. destroy the array. Let me get up there. So it's like it's hot there anyway. Oh, he looks cute. Miri, I thought I'd never see you again. He says running away from her. <laughs> Goodbye, Miri. You can inform your worthless legates that we stopped the cultists. No thanks to you. Just be grateful your little dispute didn't land you afoul of the law. Cease your mess. We did it! My little brother is safe and that backstabbing viper Zagira's plans are in shambles. Oh, I almost wish I could see what Dagon does to her for her failure. But my imagination's probably better than his anyway. <laughs> What's n uh, what next? We Yay. leave this useless sweat to his report and count to Zora's lucky stars. My little brother is alive and well thanks to you. That's more than I could ask. We owe you. If you ever need anything, and I mean anything, you can count on me. Okay, so we have her as a follower now. I should get word that we're safe to our parents as soon as possible. I, I hope to see you again soon. And Liam, straight to Leowin, you hear? I just want a moment to catch my breath and thank your friend here, Mother. <laughs> She's just like ran off <laughs> and left him again like that's great that's great that's absolutely marvelous so we have miri now as well as bastion which is cool like i said i probably won't use miri um so you can only have one at a time obviously it would be cool if we could have her brother. She's All just right. The next me. time you're helping me with something. Oh wow! Why does she sound so horrible? Hope we find something interesting today. Companion menu. Okay. So I haven't actually looked at her skills. Oh, so she's got um oh freaking what's it called? Nightblade skills. Um. Whereas, I can't remember what skills Bastion has, yeah. But I don't know, I think she can be good for healing. Um, yeah, increases damage done by 3% and healing done by 3%. So she's like, damage and healing. I think Bastion has my skill line. What See? did I miss? See? When you call Bastion, he's already nice. When you call her, she's just like, um, next time you can help me or something like that. I don't know. But he seems so much nicer than she is. What's on your mind? Um, but she's like Nightblade skill lines and he is... He's got actually my skill lines. Uh, which is Dragonite skill lines. Which is nice. So, I forgot what his racials were. 
max health and damage done so they can both be damage worthy she is more geared towards healing whereas bastion i'm gathering from this is more geared towards like the whole tankiness side of things like i said probably will not be using her really at all i can fairly heal myself okay um, so if anything i would need like bastion to just like take the reins of something and taunt it for me so um, so yeah bastion is not um oh no sorry bastion is definitely my preferred companion out of the two but that is miri's quest uh she just kind of ran off so now we have both companions I don't even really care for leveling up Miri's uh, rapport to, uh, what's the word, get her as a furnishing piece? That sounds really weird, but to be able to place her inside the house. That's uh, what I'm kind of working on with Bastion at the moment. Can I help you I'm with something? I'm working on his uh, rapport uh, to, so that I can get him in the house. Uh, so for like screenshots or whatever because I'm stupid because <laughs> I'm stupid like that um, but yeah so my favourite quest out of the two companion ones was probably Bastion's because I know it just seemed it seemed more interesting to go with the Bastion than it does Miri and I'm definitely happy to have him rather than her but call me a little bit biased but I'm definitely a Bastion fan than I am a Miri fan but anyway, thank you guys so, so much for watching this episode. I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that you enjoy the ESO videos. If I do decide to buy, oh, this is pretty. Very like flat and weird looking, but pretty. Um, yeah, if I do decide to buy like the house inside the, inside Leowim, then you guys will probably see a tour on that at some point. I can't promise it because I haven't bought the house yet and I'm still, I'm the what do you think you'll make with that? But, yeah, just thank you all so, so much for being here, watching my videos, supporting me. I really do appreciate it so, so much. It means the absolute world to me. So don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, leave comments, and subscribe if you had not already. And I will see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye.